Hello. Okay. Obviously, everything is okay. have a few things ready. Hello baby doll, hello Brenda, hello Nata, Nata Fly, I don't know, Angelica, Angelica. hello. Uh, I mixed already some paints. Hello Roxy, hello Petra, uh, hello Katty already mixed some paints with float roll and some i will mix now uh, just to show you how i will mix it and i have to say just a second i have to do this um, when i mix them with float roll i saw that uh, these paints are reacting just so differently with float roll other my pouring medium so maybe i will have some troubles with float roll we will see i see i mixed um, float roll approximately i never measured maybe this is my mistake but this is how it is. I never measure. Measure. Hello to UK and to, to Canada. Uh, so I will. Ooh. Uh, this is way too thick. Uh, I decided that I will mix it. Um, here with you so that uh, you will see what consistency I'm looking forward for my flower dips uh, and I use um, Overtroll brand Floatroll because this is everything that we can buy here in Slovenia I can't buy this float Floatroll that you use in the States so I hope that this is similar to that float roll so that we will see how this work. Uh, I already mixed um, transparent yellow and some orange. This is no vermilion and I mixed already this uh, cadmium red middle hue. And as I said, transparent yellow from Amsterdam. And uh, I have this Carmine Deep from Amsterdam Expert Acrylics. I just love this color, I have to say. And I mixed my white for background. So today I thought that maybe we can do it on a white background. Right. And I will, when I will mix this one, I will show you this rainbow results dry. The last one is not dry, dried yet, but hello from Romania. Hello. Romania is close to Slovenia. Not so close, but closer than states or australia or canada so <laughs> in europe hello crystal hello do do doina oops i'm sorry that i can't um, read all these the comments and um, uh hellos because I don't have Marina by my side today. 
Hi from Bahamas. Wow. Yes, Petra. Netherlands is, is close to me too. <laughs> it's not so close. It would take me a day or something to get to Netherlands, but it's close. We are only in Europe. So, hello, Dar. Hey, long time no see. So, I thought that maybe we should use these four colors today. I bought this little, you see, they are just little squeeze bottles just for today's life because I didn't want to mix them in my whoops bigger squeeze bottles because I don't know how this will work because I didn't do flower dips with float roll before and this is my base you see it's thick it leaves a mount and my hand is shaking hello Sue how are you in Australia? I hope that you are safe and okay because I saw that you have pretty rough fires in Australia. I will, Dar. I will tell her, but uh, she has to work tomorrow, so she has to go to sleep, not poor with me. So. This is my pearl medium that I use for my pearl white. Hello, Dolly. Okay, safe, I'm glad. Hello, Janet. Uh, so I will show you how I mix it. I just pour my white mixed with pouring medium. Today is float roll, as I said. And then I pour or I don't know. I just eyeballing everything so I can't tell you how much per medium I add. I add I don't know quite a bit, maybe third, a third of the amount of mixture of white and pouring medium. We will see if this work with float roll. Petra, did you try it with float roll? Because Petra did some gorgeous flower dips, but we use our European binder and primer mixture that works for this. I don't know if it works with, with float roll. We will see today. I think that I have enough because this is when I mix it with my other. Okay, Petra, you didn't either, so we will see today if our European European I have a layer pouring medium too, Petra. I, I want to try with um Float roll today, and I bought some PVA glue, so I want to try it to next week with PVA glue. And I have some Vallejo pouring medium, Liquitex pouring medium, GEC 800. So I will do experiments for you to see what we can use to make it work, if it will work. So this is my pearl white mixture I'm sorry my hands are a little shaking I hope that these live videos will help me and you to see um, what we can do what works what did don't work so our paints, I have this permanent magenta too. I I want to mix it at first. I don't know. Uh, I don't know about uh, gifts. Um, if I can uh, receive a flow, flood, flood, float roll as a gift because 
on our um, customs, maybe they will have a problem with um, Floatrol has some things in it, so maybe they will not be happy to import it. I don't know. I didn't try it yet. Maybe we can try. So that uh, I break this uh, talk and mixing stuff a little bit. I will bring uh, my rainbow force. Just a second. So, I will put this away because um, I played with this. Uh, I hope that, whoops, I have a lot of glare. I see. Just a second. What if I. This one, this is the first one. This one is dry completely. You see? Uh, this is the one that I lost my purpose. So, uh, but I like it. <laughs> so, um, and again, I'm with this um, talk that I talked about. Uh, when I say, I will say again, when I say I don't like this and I'm not overwhelmed is just because when I pull out up my paper towel and if I did don't get what I have in mind I automatically um, we Slovenian would say Nimiušeč but uh, I don't like it <laughs> doesn't mean that I hate it that I will scrape it or anything but I'm not completely happy with it. And uh, when I, I read this comment uh, a few days ago, when somebody wrote that uh, she learned a lot from me, but she, she will have to unsubscribe because I'm so negative. I'm not negative. I enjoy doing this, but I always see some place to improve myself. And if I say I don't like it, I'm not negative. I just, at the first moment, when I, I watch my video, most of times I change my mind because um, I, I like most of my paintings. But this is just this first moment and I just, I'm just me. I'm not, I'm not acting, I, I'm not a fake person and I said I, I don't think that <laughs> moment that I must be maybe wow great I love it because <laughs> if I don't feel it I don't say it so dar if I'm happy I I dance my happy dance and if I'm not 100% happy I just say I don't so enough of this this is the second one yes Petra <laughs> and um, I'm far from negative person so that's why this um, comment maybe hurts a little bit because um, every one of you have a right to have your opinion don't get me wrong but to say to me, thank you for uh, teaching us. And then you said, um, I have to unsubscribe because uh, I don't scream in every uh, video that I'm over the moon with my result. If I will do that at the first video, I will still be at my first flower dips that I did. And maybe you can look at them and you will see that they are quite different. So, because I experiment Oops, I see a bug in here. You see it, I have to. So, the second one. Yes, I'm just honest person and that's how I am and that's how I will be. So, <laughs> I like this one too because uh, they are not var varnished yet, they are just dry. Uh, because it's, I don't know like an underwater, like somebody said. Uh, but when you look at it, 
closer and I will when I will will varnish it uh, this um, colors will pop a little more so I like it yes Amanda <laughs> uh, so the second one I just talk and talk just tell me shut up Fiona if you will have enough of my talk and this is the third one. This is not completely dry. You see in uh, middle part is still a little wet. So here I didn't lost my red, but overall, I don't like this one. I have to say that <laughs> Rita, I, I just don't. <laughs> But I don't, I, I, I don't know, I, I miss something here. I don't know why. Maybe if I did it the opposite way from reds to, to violets, I don't know. But this, uh, I think that here is too much red and too much yellow. This is for my opinion. <laughs> so, yes, okay, I will not tell you uh, anymore. So for my, oops, opinion. Uh, if you ask me, I like the second one the most. So, and I have some dry result that I want to show you too, because I don't know if you wa watch these videos, but I really like the dry results, whoops, of these dips when I use a saucepan because they dried just gorgeous. You see this? So whispery. Yes, Dar. I, I really like this. And this one is done, uh, if you remember, here I mixed um, um, Vallejo polyurethane satin varnish in in my base and maybe I should and this one with these tulips this is um, here I mixed um, my turquoise with uh, this varnish and they it they dried really really nice you see I just love this results so i wanted to show this one and in my last video simple is the best i did some dips not reverse dips and now i want to show you those and rainbow colors again so i when i uh sh sh turn off video, I redipped it because I didn't like neither the first one, neither the second one. So I redip, redip it. And this is the first result of my redipped flower. I must say that I love this one. Uh, Wendy, I have some um, videos when I use saucepan, uh, and um, this is the second one that I redipped. This was just a regular dip, if you watched my last video, when I pour paint. So, this is the second one that I like a lot and then I just redipped and redipped and redipped and I did five of them from the and this one this one is more black but I just love how I don't know it kind of glows or something so this was the third dip. I just have to put it on the table. And the fifth. 
one. Here I, I don't know, I lost my um, yellow or yellow mix with mixed with black and became some weird color. And this is the last one when colors were a little muddy already, but it's still, oops, see this center, this beautiful, <laughs> um, I don't know, petals with this pearl white. I just love these effects with this pearl white. I can't help it. So, so I did this five from my last video when I did the dip here on my table. So the next thing that I want to show you, it's my paper napkin. Oh, somebody, I saw that somebody asked me uh, when I <clears throat> try to, to get this um, effect when I do my saucepan uh, smashes, dips or whatever uh, you want to call it, I use this. I mixed mix some of this in my base uh, color. You can see it uh, in a New Year's Eve video. I show it to you. So, uh, hello, Sophia from Oregon. <laughs> so these are this is my uh, paper napkin. It's just a little bigger than uh, normal. It's, um, I don't know, 35 centimeters by 35 centimeters. And they, they are kind of, they have two layers or something, you see. Whoops, focus, you see. I don't know, I just uh, love this more like before when I use this, um, paper napkins I hope that I will just put this a little more up paper napkins they are tinier and smaller you see uh, and I just um, love to use this uh, napkins now because I have more control when I leave them or maybe because they have these two layers i don't know i just use this lately because i like them better and when somebody asks me where i buy it i <laughs> you will not come to slovenia to buy it it's just a cheap paper napkin from our grocery store so it's nothing special it's just the cheapest uh, napkin that I get in our store. So I have canvas. Yay! Finally, I will <laughs> stop talking about things that you are not here. Probably. Uh, do you have any questions about uh, this that uh, we talked? Ah, uh, no, we. I talked. I have talked a lot, but uh, I would love to hear you talk, not just read your comments sometimes. So uh, I think that um, we should do uh, a reverse dip with this uh, paints mixed with flow troll. Uh, just tell me should we do a spiral or these puddle things? I just thinking, this is just my thoughts. What if I try to do uh, these puddles like I did um, when I did uh, this uh, rainbow dips, but just with these colors. So I will layer the same colors in these puddles and then do a reverse dip. Whoop, focus. What do you say about it? Should we try it? Yes. <sighs> okay, so just a second, I have to see. 
because I think that my when you you know that when you mix your paints they thicken up a little bit I will just move it a little to a side because it's quite full and I don't want to okay so this is the consistency you see it's whoop I was too close sorry do you see it or I hope that you see it's pretty thick so aloha from Hawaii wow whoops this is totally different consistency than when I they just feel so different it feels so different than when I mix my paints with my pouring medium uh, I don't know if you know why I use this pouring medium <laughs> for those of you who who know me uh, a little longer you know that the float roll in our country is quite expensive and then I try to experiment with some products that I can buy here in Slovenia and so I first mixed my colors with just with uh, acrylic primer or emulsion for concrete walls and then I found this uh, store in Austria this is our neighbor country state uh, and I go there once a month or once on two months period and spend almost <laughs> 500 euros there to buy paints and my Bessner acrylic binder and I and canvases and all the stuff that I need and that's how I found how I found uh, the formula that it works for me because float roll was just too expensive here because um, two and a half liters of float roll in our country costs about 50 euros. So this is about $55 or something. So quite expensive. That's why I, I, find my own pouring medium and it works just great for me so yes uh, all colors today are mixed with float roll it's not my pouring medium uh, my pouring medium is not in my hundreds of squeeze bottles on the floor so <laughs> I will just, okay. So we decided that we will do puddles. Uh, uh -huh. So maybe I will try with, start with yellow in the middle. Just a second. And I will, and I didn't do it on the middle, in the middle and orange and I will add pearl white in between two of them okay and cadmium red and this deeper red and I will do a puddle in the middle too today and now I will go from there so let's start I will not talk a lot. These squeeze bottles are just so different than the ones that I use most of the time. Yeah. So it's a little different or it's because the consistency totally different feeling is to work with paints 
mixed with float roll. So we will see what we will get. And pearl white. And cadmium red. Maybe I just mix them too thick, I don't know. Because I just don't have much feeling with float roll. And next. What? is this with this yellow I have air in this bottle whoops my whoopsies you are used to my whoopsies already yeah thank you dar Raiko just told me that you donated something. Thank you, thank you. Um, I just want to ask you, I have an idea and I want to ask you if you are interested maybe because I will do live videos every Sunday if you will be interested. If not, I will stop, but I just think that maybe we can experiment live so that you will see that I don't mix uh, some secrets in secret in credits. In... Thank you, Deborah. Uh, I really appreciate uh, all of your donations and all of you that buying my art on my auctions uh, because it helps me that I can buy products and experiment and I hope that this video helps you too and that's why I decided that I will try to do live videos every week Susan hello Susan I miss you Susan is the first one that we did live overseas pouring together pouring lessons together and I miss her Susan I hope that this year will be much much nicer nicer to you and that then we can do something together again. <laughs> um, okay. I miss you too. Uh, and I just got, you see, where? I just didn't do it. Okay, so, but I will do another round and then I will stop. Uh, and was I was talking about what I was thinking to maybe every Sunday then that I will do uh, these lives put some I don't know three four five of my dry paintings and have kind of auction if any ever anyone will be interested not today next week because i didn't varnish anything lately so none of my paintings are varnished because i didn't have time it was holidays and i painted but i didn't varnish so if you will be interested, we can do that too. This um, will go over the sides, but I can help it. So 
I think that I mix some paints a little thicker than the other ones. And now my napkin. <coughs> uh, I will put this aside that I can show you how much I I spray it. I just spray it with water to be I don't know not completely wet and not dry. I don't know how to say that. And now I will put my I just have to do some room here. Put my paints away. And then I try to uh, place it down like and now I have white paint on my napkin I have to turn it around I never spray it here where I paint so I just grab some white paint on it we're just trying I didn't do a nice job again but I don't want to stretch this because otherwise I can get uh, some weird shapes and then I press lightly um, a lot of times people ask me how much I press. I can't tell you how how hard. I just try to, when you do that, you will feel your pain, paint, not pain, paint under your fingers. Yeah. Never. Sorry, this was Slovene. I talk with my partner on the computer because uh, he tell me about some donation on auto pay or something. I will look look at it. I don't know what is this. So, uh, Raiko, the name Annette, Annette. Thank you, Annette. Uh, so <laughs> I will look at it later because I don't know what is this. So um, with the lifting, I always try to, when I start lifting, trying to do it evenly. Or how can I say that? Not lift uh, here to the middle and here just a little bit. So that's how i i'm hoping that i will get some nice pattern out of it not that every time i do but and here we go you see it's not the same maybe when i will torch it just a second i will just try to it's nice <laughs> it's beautiful but uh, you see this lacing is totally different um, like when i use my pouring medium so I think that my mixture has something to do with this um, effects, obviously. I will torch it to see if it will change. The guy. I like this effect too, it's interesting. Oh God, I like this, uh, uh, this carmine deep. I just love this color, you see. Uh, it's 
Okay. Yeah. You see, I will bring it to you. Lacing is quite, quite different than when I use my pouring medium. I did get lacing, but quite different. Uh, this is the first time that uh, I use float roll as my pouring medium for flower dips. So maybe I should mix them a little thinner. I was uh, doing, uh, I, I tried to, to feel the same, con to get the same consistency as I do with my pouring medium, but maybe I should, um, I should um, mix them a little thinner with float roll. Maybe I can do it in one of my next video, mix these colors with a little water and try it uh, with a thinner mix. But uh, after all this uh, pattern that I used for rainbow flowers, uh, obviously works nice to it just with uh, one color palette or how can I say so uh, I will just put this aside because I will mess all around uh, tell me do you want to to do a, a just a normal dip not reverse dip with this uh, paints and see what uh, what kind of result we, we will do we will get with that and maybe I can add a little water to my paints and try to do uh, Yes, Floatrol made cells, but um, when I use my uh, pearl white um, with my pouring medium, I get this lacing a little different than with Floatrol. So maybe I can put some, um, I just have to clean this up a little bit, put some water in these paints and try to do a dip and see what will happen. If we do just a dip, I just have to clean this. I will try to be quick, but I can do it quicker. I would love to use a little different uh, colors, but I mix just this uh, four or five with pearl white colors with float roll because I didn't know how it will work and I didn't want to ruin <clears throat> a lot of paint. I ruined a lot of paint through my experiments over this past year. Past year. So I will add water in my base coat too because it's probably too thick too because I really doesn't feel this consistency as I Thank you, Susan. Maybe this will be a little better. Um, because when I mix my paints with my pouring medium, when I talk of my pouring medium, you can see in the video number 208, how I mix it. I, I have my paints thicker than this. But obviously with float roll is a little different. Amanda. Amanda, thank you so much. So, and now I don't know how much water to put in this mini squeeze bottles. I didn't. Yes, Dar, I just love to experiment and... Um, I love to do it in front of you and when I 
I, I do my videos. These are mostly the first time that I do something and just whoop, trying to Yes, Petra, this um, um, pouring medium that uh, we, uh, me and Petra <laughs> uses for uh, reverse dips, I will put a little more of this pearl medium in pearl white. I don't know, maybe <laughs> it needs a little more um, and some water, of course. Um, <clears throat> Float roll dries uh, matte. Okay. <laughs> um, uh, and this binder that we use uh, dries really, really, really shiny. Uh, and when I do it on the wood, um, just my binder as a background, if you saw this, that um, it's really shiny without. Uh, Bef even before I I varnish it so I have some hmm what is the word hexagon wooden plates hexagon uh, it's not so late it's uh, 11 o'clock p.m here in Slovenia, so it's not so late. It's okay, because I don't go to work tomorrow, so I have time and I love to spend it with you, because you are my YouTube family and some of you, I, I think that I almost know, knew, know. Um, Uh huh. Yes, um, I didn't show my face today. I have just this pouring T-shirt, so I'm not dressed for uh, um, <laughs> showing my face and my. When you pour, you don't dress um, uh, like you. <clears throat> uh, like you would if you go out or something <laughs> so whoops I will just try to I'm in frame okay I will just do this just to have an orientation Oop. I am I am, I have almost half of my wardrobe, wardrobe, is this the right word? Um, uh, covered with paint. I'm a messy painter, I told, told this before, because when I paint I forget on, and I just, it doesn't matter if I uh, mess on something or something. I just fall into this feeling and I forget about everything. That's why I have my squeeze bottles like this, you see? Because sometimes I just grab them with my nasty hands and... <laughs> Yes, sometimes it would be uh, better to, but I will not film that if I will do it, <laughs> because probably I would lose some subscribers. Joke, I love to joke, but um, <laughs> not every day, but most of the days. Um, I will just spread this white paint. I hope that I, before, uh, when I do these dips, before I 
put push pens in my um, canvas I normally mark here on the um, surface uh, where I have to pour my background paint and I love to, to add a little more paint on the sides because sometimes the sides are the trickiest to cover with paint so do we do puddles again because puddles takes a long time I will just show you this one that it changed a little bit you see um, what if we try just drizzle some paint when I start when I start my dips I just drizzle some paints around in in circles I don't know what if we try that or we will not see the difference hmm But I, I'm just feeling that I just want to drizzle some paints around and see what will happen. Whoop! I will just pour it in the circles like this. I did like I pour it like this um, yesterday when I did those dips uh, with uh, rainbow colors that I show it to you in the beginning so this is how my dips started I just drizzle some paints but today I will have some pearl white in it in, in it not in it. Sometimes I just can't remember the word. And let's dip it. Whoops, I almost, almost drop it. I dropped my squeeze bottle yesterday on my canvas. So <clears throat> when I do these dips I spread paint from the middle to the sides and again I don't use cards or anything else because I just want to feel the paint underneath so under my fingers because I I don't know I love to feel paint So, and I don't have my uh, plastic taped on the table, so I hope that it will not go with me. And let's try to lift it. I will try to release. And I already see that I will not be able to lift it evenly because I don't have my plastic tape. You see? And that's why I didn't get this circled flower. It's just, I don't know. Let's torch it and see. So my pearl white with float roll doesn't work as I see. I just get cells like if I would use silicone in paints. Just so different. So weird. I was not expecting this before I 
did this um, pour because uh, I thought that uh, my pouring medium doesn't make so much difference. I will just bring you one of this um, to show it show the difference. I talk I talk about this, you see. I just didn't get this effect of um, petals. I did this one the same. I drizzled paint. Uh, yes, Sofia, Slovenia is where Melania Trump is, Trump is from. <laughs> um, uh, so, you see, totally different effect. This is with my pouring medium and with float roll, totally different. So, obviously, uh, something in my pouring medium is what creates uh, this lacing effect. Uh, but uh, yes, yes, totally different. Uh, I I just um, think that I will try to do the same, not with the same colors, but the same experiment next week. Week with uh, I bought this uh, PVA glue. This is just PVA glue, but um, we don't have glue all, and we can buy it. So. Next week, I will mix this PVA glue with water as my pouring medium, and I will try to do the same with different colors, not with these colors, so that I will not be boring. <laughs> and um, my colors didn't stay as vibrant as they are <sighs> with my pouring medium. I can't help it. I, 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 if I have to decide, I would say that my pouring medium is way better. You see how vibrant these colors are when they are dry and they are not varnished yet. You see the shimmery. I just. I must say that I can compare this. They maybe I should do. Uh, maybe I will do because I have this mixture with float roll, and I will mix the same colors uh, with my. No, it's not sold. I didn't sell those uh, yet because they uh, they didn't varnish yet. They are just done yesterday so they are half dry <laughs> they are no they are dry because uh, my pouring medium dries pretty quick so what i was talking about i will do another video this week and i will use these little bottles mixed with float roll and i will use the same paints uh, that i use in this with my mixture of pouring medium and I will do one to one, one with float roll, one with my pouring medium. So that we will see exactly what difference. My pouring medium is 60% um, of Bessner acrylic binder and 30% Dufa acrylic emulsion primer whatever you want to call it you can see in my video 208 i show the products and how i mix them these are european products so this i develop this is my pouring medium that i found i have to say that and i i will because it's 
Hello, Desert Pours. Uh, yes, it's a pouring technique. It's a deep technique. So this is what it's left on the surface. It's beautiful too. Maybe more than... I didn't show the close-up of this one. I don't know. Next life will be... Next life will be with... Uh, PVA glue mixture. But uh, this uh, week I will publish a video that I will... And then very neki, then very as a snabby prior. Raiko, then ver. Ja ne vem piše o neki. Sorry for that. This was Slovene. <laughs> so, uh, uh, yes. Um, so when I talk, uh, maybe I can do some, I don't know, maybe I can varnish some five paintings till the next uh, Sunday. And we do on my next Sunday live next week, we can do some pouring and maybe some live auction. Uh, come. Homo, ne vem, Rajko, o čem govoriš. Somebody wants to see my face. In my language. What to say? Uh, I love you all. In Slovene, I love you all. I would say, vse vas imam rada. I was sounded like a Papa, Papa loves you all. <laughs> Joke, sorry. This was just so, so weird. I didn't used to talk with you in Slovene. So what else I can say? I love flowers. Rada uh, imam rože. No, I'm not Greek. I'm Slovene. So Slovene is... Uh, quite difficult language uh, to learn so uh, maybe I will maybe we can learn one word a week so love in Slovenian in Slovenian language Hungarian I speak a little Hungarian too <laughs> so uh, love in Slovenian language is Ljubezen. Maybe you can learn this word because love is a so beautiful war, word. Uh, we have this word in our name, Slovenia. Love is in our name of our country and love is the most important thing. Spell it, please. Ooh, spelling in English, dar. Ooh. <laughs> yes, Ukraine is close to Hungary. So, Jona, jo je štet kivanok. <laughs> this was Hungary. Uh, good evening. In Hungarian, is jo je štet kivanok. In Slovene, uh, is dober večer. So, <laughs> I don't know, I speak Croatian, Ljubezen, yes, Ljubezen, L-U, I can't spell dar, I, <laughs> I will wrote it in comments, <laughs> so, oh yes, this is how it's spelling, uh, so, Germany, okay. Uh, I speak a little German too. <laughs> uh, yes, <laughs> it's like a. Uh, <clears throat> uh, <laughs> yes, uh, Ukraine is um, a Slovene. Uh, sl uh, uh, 
slovanski jezik. Um, hmm, I don't know. Uh, no, I don't speak Dutch, Petra. <laughs> but I love Netherlands. I love tulips. I love your... Um, Ooh, what is the word that you you have um, on uh, rivers? Oh, mlin. What is the word? Yes, will you basin to pour? Yes. <laughs> um, yes, we we learn uh, learned. Yes, Slavic language. Yes, I did. I can't remember. Slavic languages are uh, Ukraine and Russian and Slovene and uh, that's why they sound uh, windmill. Yes, windmill. Yes, yes, Amanda, windmill. Petra, windmills. I love windmills that you have in Netherlands. Um, uh, so what I was talking about. Uh, Trieste. I don't speak Italian. This is not my language, but um, Italian is uh, our neighbor country. If, for those who don't know where Slovenia is, we'll, our neighbors are Hungary, Marino. Austria, uh, Croatia, Italy. Did I miss someone? No. Austria, Italy, Hungary, and Croatia. We are between this. Um, how many languages? I speak Slovene. This is my first language. My second one, I will say it's um, yes, yes, Petra. I would love to visit Netherlands someday. <laughs> and uh, uh, Ireland. I love Ireland too. So I speak Slovenian as my first language, English. A little bit of German because I learned German in my high school for four years. A little Hungarian because I live on the area of our country where we have Hungarian majority, so we we have to 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 speak Hungarian too. And I speak Croatian language and Serbian language, and this will be all. So. <laughs> Quite a few languages, so uh, I can travel around the world and they will not. Yes, Petra, I would love to because uh, Netherlands is just, ich liebe dich, yes, a little one mistake, but um, I don't know. Is this in? Are you Slovene or just Google Translator? <laughs> Ooh, Italiano. No. <laughs> uh, I, my stepdaughter Marina speaks Italian, but I'm not. Uh, I forgot a lot of uh, English because I didn't spoke. Uh, English for I don't know 20 years since my my school so Republic of Georgia yes yes okay so what we achieved I have to agree I look at you wow Russia another Slavic, <laughs> Slavic visitor. So I must say that I like my pouring medium better than float roll. This is the first one. I did get some, was English meant? Yes, yes. Uh, we have to learn English in our schools from our 10th, when we are 10 years old or something. Uh, we have to uh, learn English and in high school we have to learn two languages, foreign languages. So we, sp we all can speak um, several languages in Slovenia. So because no one knows to speak, no one knows 
no one speaks Slovene, so we have to speak other language if, languages if we want to speak to anyone out of my, our country. So. so, my pouring medium I love the most, I have to say. I hope that this experiment with Floatrol helps. Uh, thank you. Uh, we should have to learn Spanish. I don't, I don't speak Spanish. Um, so I just, uh, I have to say that uh, when I listen to Spanish, uh, I, I understand something, but I can speak. So, uh, uh, so I promise that I will do one uh, with this and I will mix the same paints with uh, my pouring medium as I, I promise you, and we will see one to one the difference. And next uh, weekend, or no weekend, next Sunday at the same time, I will do live, and um, I will use PVA glue as my pouring medium. And please tell me in comments if you are in interested uh, to bring some varnish paintings and do some maybe live auction in our life, some pouring, some chatting, like today, some languages. My connection, is it okay? I'm back. Uh, Susan, I hope that we will talk some, 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 Yes, okay, I will. Uh, Susan, please uh, contact me on Messenger so we can talk there too, because I miss you, really. So I hope that you enjoy it. I did. Uh, I have a good time. I'm sorry if I didn't uh, be able to read all your comments because it's hard to pour and read comments at the same time. Uh, and... Um, don't be afraid, I will not do just flower dips in my lives every week. But first of all, I want to do flower dips with all pouring mediums that I have to see the difference because a lot of comments are, you have, uh, what do you mix with your paints? Because I don't get the same result. Uh, obviously, my pouring medium has to do something with the results that I get with this lacing because it's nothing like this lacing in these paintings. I didn't get this and I didn't get these vibrant colors. So I have to say that I love my pouring medium more than float roll, but we will see what will I say when I will use this PVA glue next week. So, have a nice Sunday. It's uh, almost midnight here in Slovenia, so it will be time to go to sleep. Uh, love, Ljubezen is the most important thing in the world, most important. If we have love and health and peace, we have all. So, good night to all of you. Lahko noč from Slovenia and see you on the next one. Bye.